Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what are tagged hooks in Cucumber? Let me answer. First of all, what are normal hooks? Okay, before I explain what are tagged hooks, we need to know what are normal hooks. Normal hooks are the methods in Cucumber projects which run the setup and tear down code. Okay, there are some uh, hook methods uh, with uh, provided with some annotations like at the rate before, at the rate after. Okay, these hook methods will run before the scenario and after the scenario in every feature file. Whereas we also have other type of hook methods like which are annotated with at the rate before step and at the rate after step, which will run before every step in the scenario and after every step in the scenario of every feature file. So those are hooks. But what are tagged hooks? Tagged hooks are specific to those scenarios which are specified with that particular tag. Though those particular setup and tear down code will only run for the scenario specified with the tag. Those are tagged hooks. Let me practically demonstrate this for you. For that, I'll switch to this Eclipse ID. And here, for example, if I take you to this test runner class, and we have this test runner, that's okay. I'll open this my hooks. Okay. In these hooks, we have at the rate before hook and at the rate after hook. At the rate before hook method will have the setup code, okay, which uh, need to be run before running any scenario in any feature file here, okay. And after hook method will have the code which will contain the tear down code or closer code which need to run after every scenario like closing the browser, etc. Okay, taking the screenshot, closing the browser, etc. Whereas here opening the browser, uh, I mean opening the URL like that, okay, it will be in the setup code. Whereas closing the browser, etc. will be in the tear down code. But this before hook and after hook methods will run for every scenario in every feature, every feature file. For example, if you take this restart.feature file, those before hook and after hook will run for each and every scenario, before every scenario and after every scenario. What if I add or convert this hook method into a tagged hook? For example, let me open some feature files here and see, for example, here, okay? So this login is there, login, okay? Login mentioned at the feature file level means will be applicable for all the scenarios in this feature file. So I'll simply do one thing. In this hook method, I'll simply write down, okay, I'll provide uh, the tag as a uh, tagged hook as uh, this one, that is uh, this login, okay, at the rate login, okay, like this. Now, this before hook method will only will work for the scenarios which are specified with this particular tag, not all the scenarios. Okay, because this is not a normal hook anymore. This setup code will only run before the scenarios which are specified with this tag. Okay, at the rate login tag. So all the scenarios in this uh, login.feature file are specified with at the rate login tag. So this uh, before hook method will only run before the scenarios in that login.feature file. Similarly, for after also you can mention in double quotes at the rate login tag name. So this will become the tagged hook now, and this will run this uh, closure code or tear down code will only run after the scenarios, okay, in the login dot feature file, not the other feature file scenarios or not any other scenarios, okay. Only the scenarios which are mentioned with at the rate login tag, for them only this tagged hooks will work. So hope guys, you got the idea what exactly are tagged hooks and how they are different from the normal hooks in Cucumber projects. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.